Hi. <clears throat> so the question is, uh, what does the DPI matter for you sending something for print? Well, when you're going to do any graphics for print, they need to be at 300 DPI at least uh, for most print productions. Um, usually for books or magazines or anything like that, they're going to require that you have 300 uh, DPI or pixels per inch uh, when you send in your work. Some print providers may ask you for something less, but if they don't, you can pretty much assume that it's 300 DPI for print work. For web work, however, um, you need to set your work for 72 DPI or pixels per inch um, because that's the size that looks best and works best. It'll give you the uh, graphics at the size that you're going to expect them when you use them on the web. So web resolution is 72 DPI or PPI and print resolution by default is normally 300 unless otherwise specified by your print provider. I want to do a real quick tutorial to show you how when you're creating a new document how to actually set those settings. So what you would do is go to the file menu and choose new. When the new dialog box pops up um, what you can do is set the size of your document now right now it's set to pixels so when we're talking about doing work for print we usually don't work in pixels we work in inches or millimeters or something like that so I'm gonna go ahead and click on this drop down box and choose inches and then uh, I'm gonna choose a basic uh, book size like six inches wide by nine inches tall and then under here under the advanced options if you click this gray triangle it'll twirl down and you'll get some additional options so here you can see where the resolution is actually set uh, at 72 pixels per inch so what we want to do is just go in here select this value and type in 300 pixels per inch and because we have this uh, link chain activated here when we change one value for the X resolution the Y resolution automatically changes uh, normally you can sit, keep your color space at RGB color while you're doing your work um, but when you send it to print you need to make sure that this is actually uh, CMYK but uh, uh, you can't actually change that in this particular interface so we won't worry about that um, but after you you know set your uh, dimensions for your document and set your resolution for your document you're ready to go just click OK and you'll have a new document and as you can see if you have your uh, rulers active that it's actually six inches wide by nine inches tall and this does have the proper resolution to uh, begin to add some graphics and send them to your print provider so hopefully this answered your question about uh, print versus web resolution and what's the proper resolution for sending something to the printer. Um, if you have any more questions or concerns, please don't hesitate to drop me a line and I'll help you out as best I can. I'll see you next time.